Hello everyone, it's Cleo here and today I'm going to be showing you how to take professional My Little Pony toy photographs. Now of course when I say professional, I do not mean that literally because I'm not getting paid for this, which means it's not professional. However, I do mean to a somewhat professional standard, we shall say. I say professional because I do not have an officially professional camera. I have a Nikon D5200 which looks like this. I do not have it right now as I've sent it away for repairs, but it's not getting repaired after all. I'm getting a new one which is the D5300. That's the camera I'll be using from now on, but I recorded this in the past so I was using my Nikon D5200, if that makes any sense to you doesn't make much sense to me. And the lens I'll be using is the 50mm 1.8 aperture. Now if you don't understand what I mean by professional kind of camera, it's the SLR camera, which, explained briefly to people who won't understand, is basically a camera you change out the lenses with for different looks. But today I'm just using what we call a prime lens, which means it doesn't zoom in or out, you can't change the zoom. You just have to move closer in or further away, based on what you want your photograph to look like, so that's what I'm going to use today. I prefer the look of it because it has the widest aperture, which means the amount of light that's left in the lens, and how blurry and bouquet you want your background to look. And I like a lot of that, so I prefer to keep the aperture as wide as possible because that achieves that look. I've chosen six ponies photographs today and I've chosen all my locations in advance, so I'll be going out into the wild taking photographs of ponies in public and no, I don't care what people think. So let's go ahead and do a little bit of time travelling back to when I recorded that. Okay, we're off to shoot some pony pictures and I'm going up the hill over the blossom. Still, you know, you get close to the lens, it distorts. Well, I can be really far away and then zoom in. I've probably got chocolate in my teeth because it's Easter. See, now I'm far further away but zooming in. Oh, right, excellent. Okay. Oh. Right the tree. I'm not good at this. Lens flare is real today, guys. I think these ones look good photography. Just out of the way there. And I can shoot against the sun. Okay, I think. I've got my perfect pony to try and get a shot with. You see this girl blossom forth in the blossom. So we're gonna try and get a good shot with this and try not to kill the poor pony. That's never my intention to kill ponies. We're going to <laughs> let her die. I was just getting a lens cap off my camera and then she died. See, the typical process is to not take one photograph, not two, but tons. Yes, I'm being taken care of. And I love the blue against the pink, but the sky is just so intense, the colour. I'm going to try and get that in one of my pony shots. I'll try and get this girly out. I'm going to get the wings out, I see that. <laughs> We've all tried shooting into the sun, maybe that'll work. Might be a little too silhouetted. Here, toy photography is to get the thing to balance. That's the whole trick of it. Now let's try up here instead. Okay, let's try that. Try and go a little higher. I love this one because she goes so perfectly with the colour scheme we've got going on today. Have I got feathers in my hair? A few. <laughs> Oh god, I've got an ant on my pony. Why are the ants in a tree? Can you think of how far that up is for an ant? You know? Oh god, there's actually an ant on there! Oh no! Fix it in post. Oh, I might have to. Pretty easily photoshopped, but the poor pony would be scarred for life. Okay, I think I'm happy with that now. If I'm not, that's too bad. Lily Blossom, you see the blossom is in the name. Some parts before, maybe I'll try somewhere else. Why are you doing it? Oh, come on, please. I'm asking nicely. I just want this to behave and get the perfect picture. And now I've got a problem with houses being in the background. Look at the dorky pose of it, oh my god! <laughs> That really is gorgeous. I get so excited just by this lens. <laughs> okay, let's go out. I've got a perfect shot with her. Thank you for cooperating. 
You have to think what was to get a little picky. And look who's the Easter Bunny! Okay, that... I think I've seen a better look before. <gasps> Straddling the blossom. So difficult to get the focus right. This is a portrait lens, it wasn't made for macro photography like this, I just like it. Lovely. Look at her, she's done. If one of those ain't good enough, she don't know what to do. I think Lil Cleo has communicated that she wants to be finished. <laughs> Lil Cleo, she jumped down. Oh, no, her name's Spring Sonnet. She has an OC name. So, roses, I guess. Now they're thorny. Sorry, potters. Oh no, I can't lose her in the bush though. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh my god. The camera's busted, man. It keeps on glitching out. Did I just get lens flare? That's probably the best photograph I've ever taken on my Instagram. <laughs> I'm ridiculously proud of that. It's all thanks to this gorgeous little lens. Let's try this girly as well. There's nothing not too bad for balancing things on. As far as flowers go. I say that, but they got their thorny they hurt. Well, something's got to be some good in there. What How is that is? I have no idea. Is it apple blossom? Oh, no. oh wow, excellent pony choice. Yeah, I know. What a fun coincidence. Match made in heaven. Hey, what plan? It's really not going to work on that one. No, did that work? Some are loving, having a blast. Some are loving, apples so fast. Met a bird, cute as can be. Met a girl, crazy for me. This is making the final cut, right? Is it? I hope so. <laughs> I don't even like Grace. <laughs> I'm just singing it for the memes. Well, we'll add that in as well. You know, the problem is with this pony, I noticed the eyes are a little bit wonky. Do you see that? He's in the camera in on that. You can see the, what that eye is higher than that eye. So I want to try and get an angle on that so it doesn't seem so. This is so perfect though. I am chuffed to little bits. This makes me so ridiculously happy. You can really tell the eyes are wrong from this side. I'm not feeling that. I think I like it that way around better. Look at this pose I'm in, my lads. Look at that. Oh my. Photography, not glamorous, not really. Anybody's welcome to donate a new camera to me. Just the body, I've got a cool lens. Oh my gosh, the bouquet. It's glorious. Look at that, oh, it's making a shadow right there. He's lifted this high, look at that. To get it up. Just keep photography is to make it seem like the photographer was not even there. Like the picture's on my magic itself. Sun's fading, we've got a rush. Okay, I think there's a problem with the camera it's saying it's nearly out of battery power but on the way back home now I think I've got all the shots I wanted and I'm really really happy with them the lighting's been gorgeous and I found so many more flowers than I thought I would I'm super super happy and I've just had a really really great time this evening it's felt like we've been on holiday hasn't it guys we've all really really enjoyed ourselves and we're back to the studio. I hope you enjoyed this video. I really, really enjoyed making it. If you did enjoy it, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Bye.